Hello, welcome to day 29 of the 30 day video challenge, the video matrix. Today's topic is um, talking about how maybe some of us have done video before the challenge or this could be our very first time. I know I have done um, videos before this challenge, but I'll just read through the topic and then we'll get to it. So we have been um, given questions that have been unique, hi Lise, and that have brought out our unique stories. What has it been like in front of the camera for 30 days talking about yourself? And where would you like to take video from here on? How will you use video with what you're currently doing now and in the future? And video is king and maybe I want to talk about why. So I'll start at the beginning. Um, I, I said on my first video I had experience with video. I had made some YouTube videos. They were tutorials pretty much about crafting and it wasn't about showing my face. It was just about um, teaching paper crafters techniques and showing them how to make projects. And, and that was cool and I loved sharing um ideas and um, the expertise that I had in that area. I had done another video introducing myself for a couple of things. Um, one was for my paper crafting stuff and another one was for when I became the chair of the Auckland School Trustee Group. Um, we have a private Facebook group and I just made a little video to introduce myself there. Those videos took a lot of planning, a lot of um, second, third, fourth and fifth takes because I had wanted to get it right. I didn't want to be saying um and ah, uh, I wanted it to be perfect. Now that I've done um, Facebook Live for 29 days, I've let all of that go. I don't care if it's perfect. Um, I just want to speak and I want to connect with whoever wants to listen. So what has it been like in front of the camera for 30 days? It has been interesting. Some days have been really easy and some days have been really uncomfortable. But I do, I do really like to stretch myself and put myself out there. So um, I'm always all about growing and becoming a better version of me and this um, video challenge has just amplified and accelerated that process so um, it has been challenging it, ha it has been challenging but it's been in such a gentle way that um, I've been able to hey Uncle Gav I've been able to experience growth and, and it's just been magnificent. So where would I like to take video from here on? That is a great question. Where would I like to take video from here on? Okay, I, I will tell you this. This thought just popped into my head. I would love to do webinars. I would love to do interviews. Um, Lisa and I had an interview the other day. Um, with Mike and Michelle, the organisers of the Video Matrix. And then when Lisa was on a her daily video the other day, she invited me on as, um, as a guest and interviewed me. And that was a lot of fun. And I really enjoyed it. And I really enjoyed the energy that we brought when there was two of us on screen. So that was really exciting. It's funny because Wayne actually said to me, oh my goodness, you were over the top. I was like, oh yeah, but I was just so excited. <laughs> so that was lots of fun. Um, how will I use video now and in the future? So right now, um, I'm going to share a little secret with you. Lisa and I have had such an incredible experience in doing this challenge and the transformation that we have experienced, we feel that it's something that needs to be shared and um, we're going to write a book. So we are going to be writing a book about our experience and inviting others to come and do the same because this, this 
challenge is by invitation. And there are lots of other challenges out there, but I'll let you know that Michelle has a, um, she's got, oh, she majored in psychology. So the questions are really thought out. The platform is incredible. The support behind the scenes is magnificent. And there's training, um, training webinars that go on as well. So I, when I first, hey Martina, when I first joined the challenge and, and was experiencing results, I thought, man, this is fantastic and this is something that I would love to bring to my audience. And then I realized the work's already been done. Why would I want to recreate something that would be potentially half as good when the platform is there, it's magnificent and, you know, why fix something that isn't broken or why even try to recreate something when that's not where my energy lies. So, like I said, just want to encourage everyone to go through this process because it is such a journey. And one of the things that, that I've experienced in becoming an online entrepreneur, hey BJ, is that there is a lot of, um, a lot of effort that goes into finding your message, finding your voice, and this process is just shortcut that. I mean, I know that there's people out there paying thousands of dollars to have websites set up, and then the designer comes back and says, well, what do we, what do we put in your copy? And it's a struggle. It's a struggle to get that message across. But through this video challenge, it has been, um, it has been really easy to be able to articulate my message and to be able to connect with, with what I want to say and with my voice and to be able to create the message and share my values. So for a free 30-day challenge to get your message clear and to gain clarity on who you are and, and, and who you want to be and that, you know, is part of creating your online brand, then that's just magnificent value. Oh, hello, Auntie Robin. How precious to have you here. So... I work with business owners and yeah, that is that is really part of the struggle and it's actually a, a, a significant cost and uh, stress coming up with those messages. So this, um, this process is really, really valuable. So video is king and talk about why. I will talk about why because... We have gone from the industrial age to the information age and now business is coming to an age where it's about relationships, it's about building trust and it's about getting people to know you and like you and that's going to make all the difference in um, building your business and building your relationships and that is why I think video is king because you know, the McDonald's and the Levi's and the Nikes of the world have their brand created. They have their um, loyal followers. But if you're new to the game, then how do you make a difference? And how do you stand out? In my opinion, you can only stand out by being you. So that's day 29 of the Video Matrix 30-day video challenge. Like I said, it's invitation only. If you want to get on and join and experience some growth in your ability to talk on camera, your ability to talk overall, which is what I've experienced, and just to gain confidence, then yeah, I, I encourage you to join the challenge. So have a fantastic day and I will catch you for day 30 tomorrow.